Yeah, for sure. Uh, I just knew it was time for, for me to step up, you know. I uh, knew my teammates needed me. Um, finally felt uh, more energy coming off the bench. You know, Coach Gar sat me for a little bit, so I got a little more energy. And when I was able to come back in, you know, that just gave me a little more confidence. You know, teammates were talking to me, coaches were talking to me, so I just got more confidence going into that last stretch. When, when you sat for a pretty good period there in the second half, what was going through your mind? You were thinking, when I get in there, I've got to do something or I want to do something. Well, what's just going through your mindset? No, for sure. When I, when I was on the bench, uh, you know, uh, the, the five hour end, you know, they were doing a great job building the momentum back up. So, you know, I, I was trying to, I was thinking, go in there and don't ruin the momentum, you know, uh, keep on adding it to that momentum. So, um, you know, that's what, exactly what I did, you know. My teammates trusted me to make plays, and I trusted my teammates to make plays as well, and we were able to get stops. Tyler, after the Providence game, <coughs> was obviously pretty upset about you know, the physicality and the energy you guys played with in that game. I feel like you guys were a little ramping up tonight, especially in the second half. How big was that to be? I mean, yeah, that, that Providence game was definitely something to learn from. Um, I feel like we, we've had a great practice as bigs um, when we split up into position groups um, and just having a, a professional approach to that's all right, we're not finishing, we're going we're gonna to get it done. And so I feel like these last two, three games, um, both me and Steven and a couple of the other guys off the bench have done a pretty good job of taking that challenge Coach gave us. You guys were both part of the Sure, it just sets the tone for us, um, sets a standard, you know, um, we're, we're back to where we want to be, you know, defensively and offensively, uh, we're back to playing Wisconsin basketball and that's what we love to see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. You know, that was a big thing for us. You know, we knew that we were in the bonus and um, probably like 13, what, 13 minutes left in the second half. So we know we had to to just keep attacking. And um, uh, we, the, threes, the threes I think we took were pretty good looks, you know, just didn't fall. You know, it's just one, it was just one of those nights. But, you know, um, we got to the rim and we were able to get to the free throw line, cover from the free throw line as well, too. I think that's what also helped us bring back that lead. Tyler, you get to the rim. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like the thing with me is <clears throat> if, a shot, if a shot's falling or not, um, I got to find a different way to affect the game. Um, you saw that yesterday, and I just I just carried my momentum over from yesterday to today. Um, and then also just, I think, um, like I said earlier, the approach and practice is really what um, sets the tone, and then it just fo follows through um, through the games. Tyler, you got MVP here. Do you feel, though, and Chuck, you can add to, do you feel like you had three or four tournament MVPs? <laughs> yeah. In these past two games, it seems like different guys took over at different points. I mean, yeah. Um, I looked the other day, we got four or five guys that are averaging double figures, and um, the way that we play, it's just going to be team, 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 um, both offensively and defensively. It doesn't matter whose night it is. Um, one guy could go for 21 night and the, and the next five. And so it's just going to be um, handling those ebbs and flows this season um, and then next up mentality, where if one guy's not having it, um, it's going to take the others to step up. And I believe that's what's going to make us so well. You know, uh, we move as one team, one band. And if somebody has an off night, the, the other teammates are going to be right there to, to set it back up. So, you know, that's why I love we, we move as one. And, you know, that's what's going to make us so good down the road.